Thanks, sweetie. Um, <laughs> how, how lovely it is to see everybody here. I wonder where Campbell Newman and Anna Bly are today. <laughs> and the rest of them. They think they are participating in democracy, but we know this is what democracy is all about. It's not about some presidential campaign between Tweedledum and Tweedledee. And that's why it's so lovely to see so many groups uh, prepared to come out today on the second day of the official campaign and say this is what matters to us, this is what this election should be all about. Yeah. And I'm very proud to say that we have... Um, well, first of all, I wanted to say um, how wonderful it is, too, because the Toowoomba branch of the Greens, we got involved in the Ackland campaign, and I know what a sad and lonely fight Glenn and Sid and Marilyn Plant had for many years, and I felt really ashamed that it took us a while before we connected up with them, because we, you know, our hearts were with them all along, but we had people like Ray Brown saying, jobs, jobs, jobs. And uh, finally, to meet up with the plants and others and, and learn what had really gone on at Ackland, it was so distressing. And so for the past few years, we've always attended the Anzac Day um, event at Ackland to say, this is what is going to happen to country towns across this state if we don't say enough is enough. And uh, we then went back to uh, the state party and said, look, this is what's happening on the Darling Downs. We need to start taking a stand. And lo and behold, our North Queensland branches said, of course, we've got the same problem. They're destroying our coast. They're planning to put in seven more ports along the Great Barrier Reef. And we've already, uh, yep, we've already seen the mess going on in Gladstone. They won't, they're not even sure what's going on, but they're not stopping that dredging. They keep going no matter what. Well, we can't let that happen to the Great Barrier Reef. So it's wonderful to have our candidate for Whit Sundays here because that beautiful World Heritage Whit Sundays area is actually going to be on the um, shipping route for freight, for big freighters taking out coal north and south of the Whit Sundays. Uh, and of course, they were able to tell us that at Collinsville there are some graziers who have eight minutes a day to get their cattle across the, across the rail line. Those coal trains just keep coming and coming. And of course, uh, the latest scandal is they all want their own rail line, all going across this good country, going straight to their own port, where it'll be shipped out to India, to Beijing, to wherever, and probably mined originally by their own workers. And it's, n it's not that these people are foreign. I, I heard somebody make some point about foreigners. The Greens have always taken a stand against privatisation and we've taken a stand against vertical integration because it's about a love of place. You bring people in from outside and they don't understand that we love this country. It might look dry to them. The desert uplands might look, you know, a strange foreign place to them. But you talk to Paola and others from Alpha and the Galilee Basin. They see the beauty in that land just as we see the beauty in the Darling Downs. And so we can't let this industry that is overwhelmingly going overseas, going back to the pockets of shareholders all around the world, uh, destroy what we know is precious just because they can't see it. And that's why it's so wonderful to work with such a diverse group. And how disappointing it is that the former country party aren't here. You know, on the Sunshine Coast, and we've got Sunshine Coast candidates here, I hope that I came up. Good point. What I wanted to say was we tried to work with the LNP at the last election because we were both so passionate about the Traveston Dam. And we finally won on that issue. And do you know there is now coal planned for that Mary Valley? And we have called on them. Come out. Make a stand. Glen Elms. You said all this stuff about how important the Mary Valley was. Now they've got plans for coal seam gas and coal mines. Make a stand. He's been dead quiet. Where's Warren Trump? Exactly. So what this is about, it's about, as Aidan said, it's not about left or right. It's about people who love country and are prepared to stand up and fight for it. And I, and, Please remember that on the 24th of March.